Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are in the world. Hello, everybody. I am Nick, the uh, admin, I guess you could say, here with uh, Discord on Top Coder Discord. Now, I, I had this brainchild at the end of last year, and um, you know, I, I spent some time trying to figure out how to get this, uh, you know, going and getting it exciting for our community. And, um, and it's kind of, it's turned out pretty well, I think. Um, if you're joining or if you're watching this recording, uh, you know, what this is, is going to be a, not really a tutorial. It's going to be pretty ad hoc. I have pretty much nothing planned for this. All right. So I'm going to be reading the chat. Um, we're going to be interacting there. Uh, I'm going to go through some things that you may not know. Uh, I am by no means a Discord, like, professional, right? Again, I, I just joined, like, Discord at the end of, uh, of last year, uh, and I'm, I'm still learning things from you guys. Um, there are some, like, Discord pros that we have here at the uh, in our Top Coder Discord server, and so I'm always learning stuff from you guys. Um, but, you know, if you are joining us from our Top Coder Slack, Slack was a little bit uh, I guess you could say straightforward to use, but I, I like to think that the Discord server that we have is is a little more engaged, a little more fun uh, to use and to keep in touch with each other. Um, and we've built some really cool, uh, some really cool uh, integrations with uh, Top Coder. So we we merged a lot of things, and we'll, we'll talk about it uh, when we get there. So a lot of the things that you'll recognize off the bat. Uh, once you log in and actually let's start there. So, you know, when you log in for the first time, you would have to go through a little bit of a process. I can't do it right now because I've already verified myself. But uh, if you are having trouble, uh, verify yourself. It shouldn't be too hard. There's a channel that says start here um, and it explains exactly how to get into our server uh, from there slash verify just pop that in the uh, verify channel it'll send you a link you log in the top coder so we know that it is you who is trying to get into our server and once you do that we're gonna we'll change your nickname in discord so that it matches your top coder name so that everyone in the server knows who you are which is a pretty cool thing and it will also um show your rating color Pretty cool stuff, and we can thank Kirill here. He's he's in the chat there. You can see him. He said hi, top coders. Everyone saying hello here. Oh my gosh, this is uh, I'm looking right now. I'm looking. Thank you, Jesse. Yes, no, that's perfect. Um, if you are watching this later, Jesse had just posted in the chat what the uh, invite link is to join our Discord server if you haven't already, and um, I assume whoever's editing this will probably. Pop it up right there. So go ahead and click it there and join our server. It's fun. Okay. So without further ado, let's just, I'll just share my screen at this point. Cool. And let me, that seems hard to read, huh? Seems a little bit tough to read. Let me know if it make it bigger for okay so the thing is is that it is maximized on my screen so let's see what i can do about that um how about i move it to my less high res screen maybe that'll work so we're gonna do a little little switcheroo here uh so how, how's everyone doing did they enjoy their weekend did the mothers celebrate mother's day i know other countries were celebrating other things uh, but hopefully you all had a wonderful weekend. And if you join our Discord server, you know that we have these type of conversations too. It's not all it's not all business. It's not all business, you know. Um, we also, you know, chat about each other's lives, seeing how we're doing. We have um is this working? Is it working? There we go. How's that? That looks a little bit better. Actually, I'll, I'll move my bubble here so you can see a little bit more. Okay. So, 
Uh, we don't have an official Father's Day here. Interesting, interesting. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I love how you know the whole world celebrates you know their holidays at different times as well. <laughs> um, so yes, this is our welcome screen. Now my my uh, Discord might look a little bit different from yours. Um, this is from my like admin view, so I have access to like every single channel. Um, if you are, uh, if you're new, you might not have all of these channels that you see here, but if you go to the welcome, uh, page or yeah, the welcome channel, you can't write anything in here. I mean, I can, cause I'm an admin, but, um, you can just, we set this up so that you can learn everything that you need to know about our discord server right here. Right. So it walks you through three steps here. It explains uh, your roles, you know, why you're red, yellow. You should already know that, but um, how to earn XP. So we do have XP in this server. Uh, and XP, for those of you who might not know, stands for experience. And that's, that's just to show how active you are on our server, which is kind of cool. Um, and the way you do that, you just chat. You just chat with your with your uh your your top coder uh other co co-workers your members here um your friends so just chatting earns you xp and you can see that let me just hop into um in general right now you see a green little uh a, a green little icon next to your handle so let's see carol 16 Jesse is nine right now. I'm at a 16 as well. Aaron, oh, we need to get Aaron back in. Uh, <laughs> need to get his his number back there. Um, but that's a good example though. So if you just joined our Discord server and you don't have a number, you just have a check. It's because you're new. You got to start chatting. So start chatting, uh, and eventually you will uh, receive a a level. So again, that'll show how um how much you've been interacting on on top coder that's how you get xp and sometimes we'll do like double xp we'll um you know so that you could just chat and we'll have it open for like an hour and you can get double the amount of xp and uh you could come here to check level this is uh this is available to everybody here check level and if you just type exclamation rank it looks like paraviki has done that so She's checking. She's like, okay, where am I? Oh, I'm at level seven. I have 12 XP in this one and I have 695 to go. And then, uh, and then I'll get to the next level. Okay. So she can see that she's ranked 38. So that's, she's uh 38th person overall. Uh, and if you type in, I don't think I, I can't do it from here. I think I might be able to. Uh, what is it, guys? Is it leaderboard? Rank? What is it? This is actually a good, uh, good test for you guys, uh, to see. You can always do, like, help or something, right? Exclamation help. So that's kind of like the, the prefix that you need is that exclamation mark. Um, oh, see? There we go. I, I told you this thing is it's going to be interactive. So in the chat, for those of you who can't see the chat in the recording, so we have Daniela who says it's pinned. Uh, again, we're just going everywhere here. <laughs> Pinning is something that we will do uh, when there's something important that we want you to remember in a specific channel. So I'm in the channel levels, right, or check level, and I think I just actually uh solved it there it's called check level and if you go to this pinned messages so like i said in each channel pinned messages is a little bit different so here is some important information that you should check out first before you ask anyone if you have a question about what goes on in a channel so in this one uh you know jesse wrote to see your level type rank and bam Bam, there it is. You'll get to see your rank. So that's what everyone's been doing here to check their rank. 
um, the levels leaderboard. So this basically shows you, I think it looks like I have to bring it over to my screen here. It sends you a link and it'll take you here. So it looks like Penna is our current leader. He's level 22. Yes, it does get a little bit tougher to uh, increase your level the more you go. So it is pretty prestigious if you um, if you get up to these higher uh, 20s level. And these people have been working on it since, let's see, February at this point. That's when we launched. We launched uh, on Valentine's Day. So yeah, that's uh, pretty cool. You can go ahead and check where you are on the leaderboard at any given time. So that's pretty fun here. So yeah, that's pinned messages. So check out pinned messages um, to uh, to help you out on your journey. So let's go back a little bit. So here it was talking about XP. Um, and oh, I still haven't updated it yet. But we just released something like last month called uh, a top coder token. And if you go to our game section, right at the top here, there's an explanation of what this top token is. Pretty cool stuff here. Um, so this is kind of like our Discord currency. And so what it is basically, if you go to token commands, you'll see everyone participating in this. You can earn tokens just for playing games. Um, you can claim your tokens daily. There's so many ways to do it. It's all described here in the top tokens area. Uh, let's see. Do I have any? So we got some pin. Uh, we have that fun pinned message there where I guessed a number on the first attempt. So a little brag there, but <laughs> everyone wanted me to post it. So I did. Uh, so what kind of things can you do here? Uh, I, I haven't checked in yet today. So every day I can come in here and type exclamation daily. And these commands, the ones that I'm going to be talking about right now, only exist in this channel. If you try to do it in another channel, it won't let you. All right. So uh, highly recommend not Pokemon. I don't know, Jesse. We, we might have some uh, people that are into Pokemon here. It is it is pretty fun. We got Vipool. I've always seen, I always see him in there uh, collecting his Pokemon and fighting his Pokemon. Um, so yes, yeah, so daily, right? So I'm coming here daily. So that's two days in a row. So I missed out on the weekend. Uh, if you if you do the daily every day uh, and you get up to a pretty high streak, you get more coins. So you get more coins by coming back here uh, daily, right? And claiming your prize. So that's all I need to do daily. And I got 86 coins or tokens on this one. I can do exclamation work. And what work does, um, you can do this every hour. And so basically saying, I'm going to start working here. And if you, if you do that, it'll say the next time you come back, you will gain this much money. So here it's saying I'm going to gain 152. I did exclamation work before and I claimed it just now for 264. So some people will do work claim just to claim it. But if you do just work, it'll claim it and it'll start your next one. So that's kind of a, a little shortcut there. Para Vicky, good, you are working. <laughs> hey, Vipul's in here. Hi, Vipul. There's the Pokemon Master that you need to see right there. Uh, other things you can do here um, are, are games. So these games have a cooldown period, and that's either of like an hour or 30 minutes. Uh, games like Roulette. So... What this is, these are all gambling games, by the way. So don't get too crazy here. We don't want to, you know, send you to Gamblers Anonymous or anything like that, okay? So uh, the max that you can wager, and, and and we're talking about the to the coins that you have accrued. So if I go to coins, exclamation coins, I have 93,000 at this point, 93,000. 
If you want to see the leaderboard, you want to know who the richest people are in the Top Coder Discord server, you can just type that in. And oh boy, look at that. PJ has 208,000. Oof, 208,000. Well done. Uh, so you can kind of see where people are on the leaderboard there. So that's a command, richest. Um, and so you can only wager at a maximum 240. So if I do 240 here, it's saying a little bit violent in the sense that it's, it has a gun to your head, but it's like Russian roulette if you you know know about Russian roulette. So it looks like I clicked it and it wasn't a bullet. So that's good. So it's like, do you want to play again? Do you want to click it again? Uh, and boom. Okay, so I I'm dead. I I lost my money. <laughs> I I couldn't get any more. So I think the maximum times you can do it is like five. So that's roulette. Uh, another one is RPS, which stands for rock paper scissors. Oh, and see, so it tells you if you do it wrong, it'll kind of help you out. It's like this is what you meant, right? So you do RPS, rock, paper, scissors, 240. I'll do the max again. And then it says, choose which one, rock, paper, or scissors. So I'm going to go rock. Let's see. Rock. My opponent played rock. It's a draw. I get back my money. Now, as I was saying about the cooldown, if I did that again, it says I need to wait 30 minutes before I get to the, before I uh, can play it again. Okay. So that's what the cooldown is. What other games do we have here? Uh, let's see. We have, okay. Thank you, Code Abby. We have Dice. And you'll see, this thing is constantly scrolling. People are always trying to gamble their money and get more money. It gets it gets fun here. Um, so this is the dice game. Exclamation, dice, betting the max again. Let's see. I rolled a one and a two. Yeah, lucky me. Lucky me. I can't. Can't catch a break today, guys, this morning here. Uh, so I rolled one, two. That's a three. My opponent did six and three. That's a nine. Nine beats three. I lost my bet. 240 tokens. Um, if you ever wonder what kind of games there are, you can do exclamation games. So we talked about dice, RPS, roulette. There's also one called guess, which is just guess the number. Uh, you have like five chances. It's between one and a hundred. It'll keep saying higher or lower, and you have to guess the number. And that's how you play that. <laughs> Jesse, thanking Cody on here. Yes, we're getting right to that. Thank you, Maddie. What can you spend these tokens on? You can spend these top co tokens in our shop. Exclam uh, exclamation shop here. If you do that, there's some instructions here. So you can uh, shop for an item or you can put the item ID. Um, and then once you decide what you wanna buy, you can use the buy commands. So uh, exclamation buy. And you could type in the name exactly or you can type the item ID, which is right below it. For example, I, you know what? I gotta spend my money because the season is almost over. The season um, ends at the end of this month, actually. So it, it runs for a couple months. Now, I've always wanted this Death Star. So let's check this out. If I wanted to shop for it, I go shop SW Death Star. And so I see it here. Ooh, look at that Death Star. It's beautiful. Actually, you know what? I don't want the Death Star. Let's, let's take a look at the Millennium Falcon. That's what it's about here. The Millennium... Oops. Shop. So you got to be specific here. All right. So you get a little gif of it. This is what you are purchasing for yourself. It costs 17,000 tokens. Do I have enough coins? 93,000. Yes, I do. So what I do here, I do exclamation buy. I can type in SW Millennium Falcon. Or I could do buy 
this uh, this code, this little code here at the end. So buy that. And I bought the Millennium Falcon for 17,000 tokens. Holy moly. So I can go to my items, exclamation items, and it shows you everything that you have purchased. Now, these will become a collector's items because everything that you see in this shop, like I mentioned, the season is over at the end of the month. Once that happens, all of these are going to basically go away. Uh, go away in the sense that I'm going to make every item the maximum number of coins that it can be just because of the way it works. And we're going to bring a whole bunch of new items in for you to buy for the second season. And we haven't really revealed what the theme is for that one yet, but it will be uh, pretty awesome. Uh, will the coins get reset? Yes, the coins will be reset at the end of each season. So you'll want to spend your tokens before that. Um, and yeah, it it'll make it fun. Once we get to season two, I think it'll be it'll start being fun because you can then give items to other people. You can start trading. So it's like, oh, you have this thing from Star Wars. I wasn't able to get that. Will you take this in, in exchange for that? So it'll be fun. It'll be a, a, a good time. And we like to have some fun too. So whenever we have special events, we will turn on double the tokens. So, and we will reduce the cooldown for the games so that you can keep playing the games for like an hour and get double tokens. And, uh, and so we usually, we'll do some of them uh, planned like a week in advance and we'll do some of them uh, spontaneous. So you just have to kind of be coming back and at least have this open. We will uh, do our best to tag you and get people to uh, participate in our bonus uh, days. So super fun stuff here. You can see Kirill in here checking on his coins uh, and Rokit showing off his items. What he, he bought a lightsaber, a red lightsaber with George R. Binks, speeder bike, Anakin, Yoda. So yes, so this is fun. This is what uh, a lot of people like to do here. Um, and it, it's, it's a great time. So those are our top coder tokens. Now we kind of only reached <laughs> number one here in, on our welcome. We, we get a lot of, we get sidetracked a lot here and it's, it's great. You have the season dates documented, uh, documented somewhere. I thought I had it actually as a pinned message here. And if I don't, or did I have it here? Oh, I don't have it here yet. But that's a good that's a good point. So I, I'll have the uh, seasons documented. Um, I'll probably put it as a pinned message in the token command. So thank you for that. Um, if you want to be productive, do not. <laughs> no, go to the games. Go to the games. It's fun. It's fun. You'll have a good time. Um, let's see. Number oh, Code Abby, number three. Sorry, I'm just catching up on the uh, chat here because I want you guys to have all your questions answered. Um, let's see, coins will get reset. Yes, coins will get reset. Are they like gifts? Yeah, so Maddie, the um, the items, I, I created it so that every item that is over 10,000 tokens is a gift. So they're, those are the animated items. Everything else are images. And I guess I can show you kind of the behind the scenes here of how like I set it up. So well, what is it, economy? So if I go to economy here, so this is what the store looks like on the back end. So there's Jar Jar for one token. <laughs> That's just a big joke there. Uh, so yeah, here are all the things. There are a lot of, lot of items that are gifts for 10,000 or more. So choose your favorites. So they'll be like collector's items, Manny. Collector's items, like little, like trading trading cards. Fun stuff. Yeah. So uh, yeah, keep keep checking those out. Take a look at them. Collect them all. Keep coming back. 
join our bonus days. It's good stuff. All right. Uh, yeah, keep the questions coming. I will be uh, reading them, answering them for you. Uh, so let's move on here. We discussed the roles, the XP, the tokens. So next up, we have the uh, the regions. So this is great um, so that you can keep up to date with your fellow top coder members in different regions. Um, so for example, I live in North America, right? So what this does, I this lets me opt into a specific region, which then unlocks more channels for me in my Discord. Um, in my Discord instance. So if I clicked North America, um, once I did that, I would then be, um, I would then be able to open up this North America channel here. So technically this is the category and in the category is the channel of North America. Right now there's only a general channel there. Other, uh, regions like southern asia they have their monday meetup set up here so um and the general so lots of conversation going on depending on which region you're in you can join any region really uh if you want to keep up to date with with them um it's, it's just a nice way for um everyone to kind of have like their little meetups or you know if they have questions that pertain to their region, maybe it's something about payment, something like that. That's um, uh, it's it's nice to talk with people that are in your region. Yes, your Af the Africa region is lit. That's what Jesse's saying. And yes, they always have great conversation going there and helping each other out. The Africa region is do <laughs> is pretty awesome. Um, see what else do we have here uh are there any plans to turn coin into real world items like vouchers discount codes tickets to tco yes those ideas are out there maddie uh it might not be discord related it might be something that we that might be coming to the platform sometime in the future so you're definitely on the right track there you're definitely on the right track with things that we are looking to uh create here um in uh at top Gun, so Great job. Uh, let's see. Uh, okay. Yeah, let me just get through this real quick and I'll get to the music, Vicky. All right. Um, okay, so that's region. Uh, you opt into whatever region you want to and it'll unlock channels. In the same vein here, number three is select interests. So once again, if you join, you can join one of these tracks. So there's one, um, there's a one reaction per track here. So if I want to join marathon match, I click this little running man. You know, if I want to join the NASA community, that's a new one. Click this rocket. So for example, if you click that rocket, this uh, program section will open up for you and you can join the NASA community where uh, we will be updating everyone on the latest with the NASA challenges that are coming out. So really cool stuff here. Um, what do you think, Jesse? Do we have, um, who's leading this? Is it Kelly? Kelly and uh, Dan? So you, yeah, join the NASA community and get updated here. Uh, we will probably tag the channel whenever something important comes up. Um, and if you want to join competitive programming, that is a popular one too. There's always discussion happening in here, uh, you know, discussing the recent SRMs, sharing, um, articles, things like that. You know, if you have any issues, you can come to arena questions. If you're having issues with the arena, um, you know, finding out when the next SRM is, this is an automated thing. So Every time one gets added to the calendar, it'll be posted here for you. And then you can add it to your own calendar by clicking the link. In other, uh, in other tracks at TopCoder, you know, like the development track here, they'll have its own general channel. You know, look at Vipool, always, always uh, uh, 
putting out these great article links here. Uh, he's everywhere. He's everywhere in this uh, Discord. Uh, uh, talking about automation, we also have Challenge Launched. This is in every uh, track as well. So Design has one. And what these are are automated um, posts that will show you the latest challenge that has been launched. So it's kind of a one-stop shop. If you're just interested in design challenges, you can just know that every time it gets posted here, um, that's the latest the latest uh, challenge on Top Coder, and you can join it straight from here. So pretty pretty cool stuff. Um, going back to the chat for a second, hard to keep. <laughs> Uh, yeah, i just, there's just so much, man. There's so much, uh, turning things into real world items could help people and their families and their everyday lives. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Um, awesome. Okay. So we have gone through, let's see, roles, regions, interests. So regions and interests, those will unlock different channels for you. Now, we wanted to create this so that there is, uh, so we, it's personalized to you. Top coder, the top coder universe is big, right? There are a lot of interests, you know, you could be interested more in learning. You could be more interested in just design, you know, development. So we wanted you to kind of create your own adventure, be exposed to the things that you want to be exposed to all while having some fun, right? So we have all of, um, all this opportunity for you. And if you have any questions, uh, you can always ask in general. Like everyone is so helpful here uh, in our server that if you have any questions at all about how anything works, you can just, you know, come here. Someone will answer you in, in minutes, which is great. So look, we've got people promoting this. <laughs> the gift games are great. Uh, we, yeah, people here are pretty funny. <laughs> So uh, our announcements, now these are for big announcements that we would like to share with you. Um, and this is, I, want, I don't wanna promise anything, but I think this is the only place that will tag everybody. Um, and these are just for really important announcements that we feel like you should know. So go ahead and check that if you feel like you're missing out on any big, um, big announcements see we um we're talking about the top token here i think this is uh here we go season one so this is where i had it this is where i had it jesse who is in here um so yes announcements check that out you'll be pinged there every so often not too often we have gotten uh, some feedback that they didn't want to be tagged too often which we understand um and then what's out? Uh, general, obviously, just general chat. Meet the team. So everyone who's well, not everyone, but most people who are in orange here, uh, especially our community managers, have wrote a little blurb where you can go ahead and read about them and read about you know how they can help you. Maybe someone's more specialized in an area than the others. Um, uh, we have some surveys that we do every so often. So, uh, for example, we had one where we ran a challenge, an ideation challenge, um, to name this new uh, top coder learning system, right? And so we we came to a, uh, a conclusion of five five names that we liked, but we needed help, right? Which one did you guys like the most? And it looked like Top Coder Academy in this one had. Um, one. So we have fun little surveys like that. Jesse had one here that you could have uh, completed on type form. So surveys are fun to do. And, you know, every so often we will reward you for participating. So that could come in tokens, maybe bonus tokens or, you know, a shirt or hat, you know, things like that. Um, about TCO, we will get this more populated. <laughs> Jesse's on it. Uh, the TCO queen will get that up for you. So you can, uh, if you're not familiar with what TCO is, you can learn about it there. Um, the general Top Coder Open, if you just want to talk about Top Coder Open in general, 
that's what this channel is for. We talked about the level. Um, again, some of these channels you can't see on yours because it's uh, I'm just in admin. So gamification was one of the other um, channels you could opt into. This is something that I'm working on, something that Maddie alluded to earlier with, uh, you know, it's like, hey, can we do something where we can win tangible items? Yes. So these, this is the kind of ideation. It looks like here, Paravicki had put a document in here with her ideas. So you're helping shape the, uh, the top coder um, gamification. Uh, so we're working together. And that's what, that's what the beauty of Discord is, just ideas and people coming together. It's great. Um, so then we also have this learn category and let me expand this cause I, is there more, or I think that's all of them. So we have thrive articles, which is whenever a new thrive article is published, it will automatically be posted here. So you always get the latest on, uh, with the articles that we release, and then you can discuss them here. Uh, you can't talk in this channel. This is only for posting the articles, but you can then discuss it in article discussions. So if there's one that came out recently, you can post it and say, you know, write your thoughts or ask a question. Um, so check that out. It's really, really cool conversation going on in there. Uh, general learning, uh, just general learning discussions. Vipul is always, again, posting links, really cool links, helpful links. Um, that can, can help you. So good stuff there. Uh, skill builder competition. You know about our skill builders on Top Coder. This is where uh, they will be posted, but this is, this is one of the few channels where it'll be posted and you can respond to them as well. All right. Oh, it looks like we got our, one of our rated, red rated members in here. <laughs> okay. I guess they don't like the uh, the notifications, but these are these are pretty important. These skill builders are um, are important challenges that we feel everyone should know about. Um, Vipul, oh, more <laughs> more helpful articles. Thank you. All right, so check there for the latest on skill builders. We were talking about the games here. We did the tokens already. Um, games. A lot of people like to play the Minesweeper game here. Uh, and I believe, yeah, there you go. The pin message. If you want to learn how to play with, uh, it's called rock puppy. They have a variety of games here, but minesweeper seems to be the most popular one. Typing club. This is Daniela's baby here. Um, after the introduction of type racer and people wanting to, uh, to, uh, it, help their typing speed um has have come here and i believe daniela you said you've you've improved a lot um going from like 40 or something 40 words per minute to like 90 now yeah luis is part of it too so uh it's a lot of people that come together type racer is a uh is a game that you is a website game you go and play against other people they give you a paragraph and you have to type it correctly and fast right um, so a lot of, uh, support here and, uh, I believe they send out helpful links too, to help you with your typing. So this, this is a pretty popular, uh, channel on our discord server as well. Pokemon. This is what, uh, we were discussing earlier, Jesse and Vipul is, is crushing that. Oh, Kelly, look at Kelly making her Pokemon, catching her Pokemon. And Rokit still is doing that as well. Awesome. All right. So this is what this is what uh, Vicky wanted to talk about. Um, did you have a specific question, Vicky? While I go through this, so this is our music lounge. Uh, pretty, uh, it gets pretty popular here at times, uh, and it's kind of nice to have, even if you just have it on in the background. And basically, what this is. And this coincides with the Music Lounge, which is a voice channel. So it looks like Kirill, Jesse's in there. And what you can do here is you can search for whatever song you want to hear. 
All right, so Jesse's Jesse's just going into play, <laughs> but let let's back up from there. So if you were looking for um, I don't know a, a Foo Fighters song, you could do search Foo Fighters, and it basically is looking up on YouTube and specifically um, music, like it's got to be tagged music or something. I don't know. Um, so you look at this and you're like, oh, is that is that the one I wanted? Yeah, Everlong. Everlong's the one. So I put uh, number six, because that's what that one is, six. And so it added it to the playlist. So if I go to Q, I can see that right now the coding music is playing. And it's like 51 <laughs> minutes. Uh, so uh, they're going to be listening to that for a while. Unless you have the DJ role, you can skip that uh, that song. But it looks like uh, Kirill's jamming out to that. So that's cool. Um, so yes, so you search for it. <coughs> you choose the number and it'll add it to the, uh, the queue. Now, if I wanted to, if I knew exactly what I wanted, so I want uh, safe and sound capital cities. I can just type that in with the add command. And cause I'm, I'm like, okay, yeah. See, they knew exactly what I was talking about. So that one just adds it straight to the queue. So you can see that pops up right there at the end. Um, so you, okay. Yeah. We were talking about this, right? Vicky. So only your right speaker works for it. Found out that it is because of the mic being on the other side. I wanted to ask if you change your audio settings to press to talk, or I don't remember the exact setting. Would it solve this? Um, that question I am unsure about because I think the same thing happened to me. I it was only playing out of my right speaker. I asked someone to look into that. I don't know if anyone did. So, uh, yeah, we'll we'll keep that in mind. We'll keep that in mind. Um, I think, does everyone else experience that as well? Uh, Daniela or Jesse, that you can only hear music out of one side of your speaker? No? Okay. So maybe it's just me and Vicky. We'll figure it out, Vicky. We'll figure it out. Um, so when you're in the music lounge, I don't want to go in right now or else you can hear it. Um, if you click the deafen, which is the uh, the headphones down in the bottom left section. It looks like Jesse has it on right now. Actually, I can do that. So we go in the music lounge. You hear the music playing. I click deafen and then I can't hear the, the music, but I can still be in the lounge. You know, maybe I am joining a meeting or something, right? So. Uh, I, I click that and then I can click undeafen and I'm back in the game. And I'll just make sure I'm muted there. And you can see Jesse, oh, look at Jesse making, <laughs> hanging out in the music lounge. Awesome. Every so often um, we will, I don't know, we'll just have like a random Thursday or Friday evening where we're just playing music for each other. I love this because people put in music from their region. So it's like, you get to hear a lot of different uh, music that is, you know, either popular or, you know, something that they want to share with everyone else. So I like just being in this lounge to hear other people's music. It's really great. Yes, just make sure you're on mute. And that I'm just, I'm guilty of that all the time. So <laughs> just tell me, just tell me I'm off mute and, and I'll get off. Um, Yes, if you click on video, you'll show up in the lounge. That is true. Abby's loving the beats. So yeah, that's that's how, uh, pretty much how you use the lounge and how you play music as well. So those commands won't work unless you're in the lounge. So that's another thing to mention as well. Um, all right. So uh, that does it for music. Random. Random's gonna be random, right? We have uh, tons of, of channels here that although random, can, you can still drill down into, right? So if you're talking about tech, we have a tech random area. Of course, Vipple's in there. Oh my gosh. 
I don't know. I think he is the internet. He is the internet. He knows every website ever made and we'll share, we'll share it with you. Uh, equipment flex. Yeah. If you have, uh, if you have some equipment you want to share off with everybody. Ooh, look at that. So starlight Jason built his new PC showing that off. So really cool. Um, really cool channels here. We've got the birthday shout outs. So you can add your birthday to this list and uh, it'll remind everybody that it is your birthday. Uh, if you go to pinned messages, this is one place where you could use it. Um, you do that command, remember birthday, and uh, it'll, it'll remember it for you. And if you wanna check out whose birthday is coming up next, you do the next birthdays and we've got Exabi, Exabi, May 23rd. So we have a few days left for that. 13 days we'll be celebrating him or her. Culture exchange, it's fun. Just news from around the world, uh, you know, places to visit, really cool stuff. Uh, if, you know, if you're going to start traveling, this will be a cool place to come and, you know, Get some insight of that part of the world. Maybe get some cool suggestions. Be cool. Uh, memes. Everyone loves a good meme. <laughs> Share it here. I think Ketz is the meme king in this one. So, uh, Kir oh, Kirill's got some too. He Kirill has some uh, some front end jokes here. Next on my list, CSS. <laughs> Oh boy, this used to be just be called Food Channel. It used to just be the Food Channel, uh, but Butter Chicken seems to be a very popular food choice here at Top Coder. So we had to add that in as well. Uh, animals, yeah, you know, you know about animals. Share your pet. Share some cool animals, some cool animal videos, some funny animal images. It's all here. If you need that break and just need to look at some animals, that's that's where you're gonna go. Sports, oh yeah, cheer for your team. Uh, ask if anyone's watching a game. I saw that some people were had the were watching a uh, Manchester game or something together. It was great uh, watching them go back and forth. Uh, if, if if you love reading, this is a good spot to go to. A lot of recommendations. Um, I'm not huge into reading. I should be, but, <laughs> uh, if you are, please come here. It's, it's, uh, it's pretty cool stuff. Uh, movies, TV, obviously, you know what that's all about. Get some recommendations here. Chat with some people. We got Top Coder Nation. This is another popular, uh, category here. Where are you working today? Let us know. Um, People always posting some really cool stuff. Oh, who's this? Rokit. See, Rokit's just posting about his holiday in Africa. Oh my gosh. Sporting a... You have some Top Coder shirts on? Oh no, that's your Twitter shirt. Your Twitter developer shirt. But it's cool. It's like you can travel the world and you're just here. You're just here with us. Taipei. Look at that. So definitely uh, urge you to go check these places out. Uh, Diablo World. This is a, a big designer spot, I believe. Um, so, yeah. Uh, in support, support, we have open a ticket. Now, this ticket is not the same as opening a support ticket through email. Support at topcoder.com. That support at topcoder.com is important to use if it has anything related to do with the website itself. If you have questions about Discord, this is the place to go. So you'll go here, create a ticket. And when you create a ticket, it'll open up a ticket at the top of your Discord. You click here, it'll welcome you and be like, hey, I need help in the general channel, blah, blah, blah. So once you do that, we'll see it uh, on our end. Uh, myself and the community managers will see that and we will help you. <laughs> so Jesse's already responding to me, right? Um, so we can help you uh, privately. If you have any questions, you want to get direct 
contact with us, that's the best way to do it. Um, so we have that. We have Discord suggestions. Is there something that you'd like to see in our Discord server? Post it in here. Uh, if you get any spam, if you see any spam from any of the channels, or if you're getting spammed in your DMs, you can let us know here so we can help take care of it. And I'm glad that this channel isn't being used too much, which means we're doing awesome uh, keeping the bots away. Um, and then the rest is all the stuff that I was mentioning before, the tracks, the regions, and things like that. So uh, I've definitely covered a lot. I've been talking for 50 minutes. If there is, uh, do you guys have any other questions? Um, something I might have missed, something that you're interested in talking about. Now's the time to do it. Um, let's see. Uh, yes, I, I'd like to give a shout out to uh, Kirill. He's done a lot of the integrations that you've seen here. He's uh, He's been able to, to put all that together. So you're your top cutter um, colors, your rating colors. He, he put that together. Um, and then Daniela has helped me uh, with all of the, the graphics type things that you see here, the banner at the top, uh, a lot of the events that you see. Oh, events. That's another great thing. See, if I just keep talking, I'll, I'll find something to talk about. So at the top here, you'll see all of our events. So right now we currently have 12 that are um, that are either happening now or upcoming. Obviously right now we have the getting to know Discord and we also have this hydropower operations. Look at that. So all the information that you'll need for the event is here, where to go, um, you know, how to get there, uh, when it is, and you can so you got their SRM announcements here. So you can say that you're interested in it. You know, get a reminder about it. Read more about it. Things like that. So definitely keep up to date with our events. We'll try to also um, remind you in the uh, in general or or wherever it makes most sense. All right. Um, I've gone through most channels here. Let's see, Vipple. The thing about Discord is that it uses the user's local time. Otherwise, no one has to do the conversion manually. Uh, it does use the user's local time. We have been trying, oh, for the events. You're saying for the events itself. Yeah. Uh, so... So this, I thought we did do a test on this and that this says tomorrow at 6 p.m. for me, but I think for you, it should be, it should be local time. So you shouldn't have to do any conversions here. So, okay, good. 3 a.m. for you. Yeah. So it should be in your time zone. So no need to do any conversions. Okay, now let's see. Ba, ba, ba. Is there any other questions before we wrap this thing up? Uh, again, I know I was talking a lot here, but uh, hopefully it was helpful to you. Uh, I'm trying to think if there's anything else you would need to know. Um, I covered a lot of the the important items here though. But I want to thank everybody here that have been asking questions. Um, show D, oh, you want me to show DMs and video hackers. Okay, I mean, I don't use this too often, but yes, we do have DMs. Um, so with DMs, you can go to your home area. It looks like I have some here already. Uh, let's Talk with Abby. So Abby's helping me out here. Some people having issues like getting into Discord or something. So we can, um, sorry, just reading here. It would be great for those still trying to use Slack. Yeah. So if you're using Slack, so you can come up here, find or start a conversation. 
And I, I'm going to say Jesse. So I want to talk to Jesse or what's her name? Jane. There we go. JMPLD40, which she will not tell us what JMPLD stands for. And apparently will never tell us. So thanks a lot for that. Uh, so I want to talk to Jesse. So I can do that or I can just do Jesse. And uh, can I do Kirill as well? Oh, I see. I have. Talk to everybody. <laughs> awesome. Uh, yeah, so you could just, like Jesse said here. Actually, let me just bring Jesse on here. She she loves this part. So I want her to, to come up. Actually, can you join the green room? This will help for the uh, the video portion too. Discord Nitro, yeah. Maybe, maybe. Hi, Jesse. Oh, hey. Yeah, there she is. All right. So, what were you saying here? You can chat with co-pilots, right? So, I know a lot of you are still using Slack. We wanna, we're gonna eventually get rid of it for sure. But um, it's a great another way you can chat. So, if you're using community Slack still in some way to have private chats, you can do that here through Discord. Just to show you that you can do that. Um, the only caveat is you need to add them as a friend first. So you have to be have them as a friend before you can chat with them directly, which is great because then people can't harass you. You can just say, no, I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> um, and the other cool thing about that is, as well is the live hangout. So um, Nick and, and a few of us on my team, we have a live hangout that we just join every day for 15, 20 minutes, quick stand up and, and see how things are going. So there's always the ability where you can jump in here um, live and, and be on camera or even just be on audio and um, chatting. So it's a great addition to your work life. So yeah, naturally this is for fun and it's for engagement and whatnot, but you can also, you know, be productive as well. Yeah. So there's also this live hangout um, that we have here and we'll, you can use it uh, whenever you'd like, but we'll use it for, you know, either making announcements or, you know, talking about something fun. I don't know. We'll, we'll jump we'll in there ad hoc and do well. some prizes, right? Just yeah. hang out. Um, so it's a great opportunity to, to meet some folks. Exactly. And here you can have the option on the bottom left is kind of where your little um, command station is. So you can turn on the camera. You can you know, choose a fun little background if you wanted. And you, know, you could share your screen if you wanted. Um, Unmute yourself. Remember, that's what we were talking about before. Um, I'm not going to do that here. And the way to leave a, uh, a hangout, like a voice chat like this, is this button here. It's like a telephone with an X. And we'll say disconnect. And it'll take me right out of it. So that's pretty simple stuff there. Um, Okay. Yeah, and in the chat, they're talking about the uh, boost. So Jesse is making sure that we are constantly boosted. <laughs> and I'll show you guys um, what that actually means. So here we go. There are three levels to boosts. And this is something you can look up online as well. But um, she has unlocked all of these um, for us. So if you have uh, a boost discord nitro i don't know if we have nitro though no okay so it's something a little bit different um yes yeah, so as pj is talking about here you can use other servers emotes in um uh, in uh, other servers right so like for example top coder we have these are our um emotes that you might not be able to use in other servers. So we've created them here. Um, and so you can't use these in other servers unless you have Nitro. And I don't think we can even use, can you even use the GIFs? Yeah, see, I can't even use the animated GIFs because I don't have Nitro. So uh yeah well i'll talk about this with jesse maybe we can uh gift some nitro 
we'll see how much how much that costs and things like that yeah 14 boosts all by jesse i know right jesse keeping us uh keeping us cool here in uh <laughs> at in the top cutter server all right uh i think we are wrapping up here once again thank you so much for joining uh if you're watching this later uh reach out uh join the top coder server if you're having any issues you can uh you can direct message me if you'd like um or open a ticket or ask in the general server I'm sure someone will be happy to uh, assist you. All righty. Uh, thanks so much, PJ. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Vicky, I hope you uh, hang out more often and, uh, yeah, and get all the designers in here. Teach them. Teach them. Um, yeah, and we'll get we'll, – this server is already amazing, but it's going to get even better. We've only been doing this for a few months now, and it's it's really fun. It's a good time. So thank you guys for joining. Um, and yeah, I guess if there aren't any more questions, uh, until next time, have a good one. Bye, guys. Have a great day.